six. Are you available? Copy. 240 negative? Sorry. False alarm on that code red near Magnolia. Try that carpet shop off Post Alley. Thanks, 30303. Copy. Dispatch, I need to run a license check on that 10th. Officer Matthews, I've got a 1010 in progress. 1452 Lewis Avenue. I'm gonna need backup. Copy that. All backup available. It's gonna be all right. On the ground. See you tonight! Don't be late, losers! Okay, update time. You heard back from Jen yet? Um, no. I'm sure she'll reply at some point. Let me take a look at the situation. Hey, Jen, you going to the party tonight? Dude, we talked about this. Could you have any less game? <sighs> I'm no good at this. Ooh, how about... Yo, Jen, see you at the party. Let me know if I should bring handcuffs. <laughs> oh my god, you thirsty bitch. Here, let Lila the Love Witch work her magic. Okay, just don't make me sound like a loser. I said matchmaker, not miracle worker. Hey, hold on. Let me check it before you send. Too late. Would be awesome to see you there? What? I could have texted that. It's a good start. She'll text back, you'll see. You know, I don't even know if I want to go tonight. Oh, please. It's gonna be fun. You hate every party. Oh, because they're all the same. Too many people, too fucking loud, everybody's wasted. Yes, Sean, you just described a party. Well... The suspense is killing me. It's dad. Wants to know if I'm coming home after school. <sighs> Jeez, I'm not a 10 year old. He just cares about you, Sean. Anyway, you should be happy your dad's looking out for you. Oh, it's Jen saying she can't wait to see us at the party. What? Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Told you I would work my matchmaker magic. Hmm. So. So what should I wear tonight? A condom. Oh, ha ha. Paying plenty of attention in sex ed class, I see. Hey, lovebirds. Back from the loony bin? Shut the fuck up, dickhead. Damn, your neighbor's an asshole. Yep. Always true to himself.
Man, we need to find a couch for your yard one day. <sighs> Ooh, careful. Last time my dad almost busted me out here. Because you were alone? Your dad wouldn't bust me. He loves me. So, you want to hit or not? Hmm. Nah. Maybe at the party. Track stars aren't supposed to smoke, you know. Yeah, sure. I'll remember this when you're begging for a spliff tonight. Speaking of weed, I got that covered tonight. What else do we need? Eric said his parents don't leave shit at the cabin, so we better make an official party list. Hey, whoa, what the hell are you don't doing? Don't move. You're my human post-it note. First, we need money for supplies, munchies, chips and dip, soda, etc. Uh, this better wash off. And of course, we must not forget the booze. I can probably snag a six-pack from Dad if he's got enough. Hey, did you ever think of maybe just sending a text instead? Hmm. Oh, right. Blankets. It's gonna get so chilly tonight. You and Jen are gonna need something to snuggle under. Oh, one last thing. C-O-N-D-O... Ugh, stop. You're out of room, punk. Is this how you see a penis? Damn, you should try and actually see one for real. You don't want to go down that road, dude. My chances of scoring tonight are probably ten times yours. <laughs> you wish. Oh, these fucking planes, man. I want to hate them, but I'll miss them so much if I move somewhere else. Shit changes so fast. I get so emo sometimes, wondering what will happen to us once we graduate. Will you still be my BFF? Will shit ever get better than 1452 Lame Avenue? Yeah, man. Friends forever. Yeah, but what happens if we go to different colleges? Or you get sick of me? Whatever. Uh, you heard of the internet? <laughs> No way distance can tear us apart. We're freaking fighters. Yeah, you're right. Best freaking fighters forever. Okay, it's getting way late and I gotta pick out my outfit for tonight. Skype me later when you're ready. Hugs. Talk to you soon. Hello, Friday night. Hey, perfect timing. Just the sun I wanted to see. Oh, sure. But I'm a little busy. Did you see Lila? She said we can go to the movies next week. She said- Dude, bug her, not me. You're not exactly her type. You're lucky she puts up with you. Ugh, jeez. Thanks, Pop. I feel really supported right now. You're welcome. And now we need an objective judge. That would be you. <sighs> really? Hey! No fair. Court is in session. Judge Diaz presiding over the case of the last Choco Crisp. I... I have to go, uh, get ready for a party and stuff. So... Well, if you want to attend to a party and stuff, you have to earn it, Your Honor. Oh, shit. Hey, he swore. Yes, I heard Tattletale. Mm. Please, Judge Diaz. Be an example to the court and society. Then you can go hook up or chill or whatever. Now, who deserves to eat this final choco crisp? Your adorable little brother who eats about 10 bags a week or your poor suffering father who slaves over a hot engine to provide his family with a home and a garage? Me, me, me. Come on, judge. Shh, shh, shh. Let him decide.
Judge? The verdict, please. You're both guilty of wasting my time. Case closed. What? No fair. Dad, dad, dad. What is this? Mm. My own flesh and blood tosses me under the bus. He sucks. Okay, back to work. I hear an engine calling my name. And you better play nice together, like you always do. Yeah. I have to work in my room, too. Yeah? Don't hurry back. <sighs> okay. Let's get this party list started. That'll do. Bet there's gonna be a keg at the cabin. Okay. Better take that instead. Cross that off the list. Drinks down, food to go. I hope there's also, like, real food at this party. Lila's so hyped up for tonight. Better hurry. Every Christmas, Dad wants to watch the Lord of the Rings trilogy with us. That's cool. I'm broke, so... I bet... All right, Dad. Where do you put the blankets? That you, Choco Thief? Yeah. Yeah. Don't get too excited, kid. You're making me nervous. Hey, since you're creeping around up there, can you pass me the wrench in the top red drawer over there? Sure, can do. Um, there's no wrench here. Ah, shoot, must be somewhere else then. Take a look around. I know I left it nearby. It's a 16 millimeter reversible flex wrench. Jeez. Oh, that was definitely my plan for tonight. So, yeah. Hold on. Sam came by the- Hey, I got it. I think. Nah. I need one with the black switch on it, so I can change its direction. Hey, did you get your English midterm back? Uh, yeah. I got a B. A B? Here you go. Hmm, wrong size. I need a 16 millimeter.
Hey, I got it. I think. Hmm. Should have a flex head. I can't reach that bolt otherwise. Okay, hey, forget it. I'll do it with this one right here. It'll probably work. Oh, shit! All right, never mind enough of this. I'm done. Hey, quick tip, my son. Go Google wrenches and see what you can learn. Yeah, um, sure. I know it's not your thing, but you gotta learn a trade. Art, athletics, engineering, I don't care. As long as you put your heart into it. I'm trying. I just don't know what direction to go. You're only 16 years old. You've got time to figure it out. Trust me, took me a while too. And you happy with it? I mean, your job, living here? Of course I am. We're doing great. Maybe one day when I retire, I'll go back to Mexico, to Puerto Lobos. But until then... Ugh, I've heard this one before. Hmm. I don't even know why I'm fixing you a sweet car for graduation. Well, you don't have to. I mean, it's cool. Are you sure you're my son? You don't want to visit Mexico. Don't want to have a car. I can't even get you into Rush or Santana. Are you going to ride the bus for all your dates? Like I'm going on tons of dates. Not when Daniel's cock blocking me the whole time. He's nine. He doesn't even know what cock blocking is. He looks up to you, Sean. Try and help him. It's what family is for. Things are kind of scary out there in this country right now. Yeah. Oh, um, by the way. Ha, I was wondering how long it'd take. You need money for the party tonight, right? <sighs> ah, 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 shh. Just be honest with me. No bullshit. Are you using this money to buy alcohol? Weed? Um... I mean, yeah, probably. But we'll be partying at a house and nobody's driving home. I swear. Well, everybody's got to get home somehow. But yeah, you and Lila better not get in any car with somebody who can't walk straight. Holy shit, 40 bucks? Really? Yeah, why not? You did a good job on the lawn. Plus, I appreciate that you didn't lie to me. Thanks, Dad. Just be careful. That's all I'm asking for, okay? I know what kind of crazy shit kids can get into. When you were my age, did you party a lot? <laughs> Sorry. What happens in Mexico stays in Mexico. Now get out of here before I change my mind about that cash. And keep an eye on Daniel while you're home, would you? <laughs> all right. Thanks, Dad. Hey, hey, hey. Not so fast, Shawnee boy. Don't you think your papito deserves a hug? Ugh. Okay, have fun. But not too much. I won't. Promise. Bye. Love ya. I love you too, hijo. I bet Dad had a pretty wild teenagehood, even though he won't tell. How long is he gonna keep all this shit?
asshole. <sighs> Not sure Daniel was ready to be an uncle yet. Man, I so don't want to work this weekend. Lila provides the weed tonight. I better be ready. Come on, open up. Why? Because. Okay, okay. What are you doing in there, Dr. Frankenstein? You ate my choco crisp. Don't be pissed. You always see the whole box. What's with the sisters? You'll see, but not now. So don't come in. Okay, fine. Don't tell me. After all, I'm only your big brother, who looks after you and takes care of you. Stop it. All I can say is, watch out for my costume in three days. This Halloween is gonna be awesome. Are you going to the party tonight at Eric's house? Will Lila be there? Yes, 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 and no. You can't go. Teenagers only. I bet Lila would let me go. She's way nicer to me than you. <sighs> Did she ask about me? Yes, she wants to marry you. Shut up! And I don't even care if I can't go. Because, because I have secret stuff to do, alone. Of course you do. Daniel's always up to something. Wonder what's next. <laughs> At least I don't have to help Daniel out with math. Thanks, Dad. Do not enter. Ever. <sighs> Trust me, Dad. I won't. If things go well, should I bring Jen back here? Maybe Dad won't like her, or she won't like him. Or worse, she could get along with Daniel. Dude, stop. I'm not even dating her. Yet. Not done yet. That's right. Que pendejo. It's good to be the judge. Daniel destroyed our old nativity scene. 
Sorry, baby Jesus. Thank God I don't have to take one of Daniel's. I'm sure Dad won't miss one blanket for the night. Looks like I got everything. Better pack it all up. Finally ready to go. Time to Skype Lila on my laptop. Sorry, Lila. I'm just not a selfies kind of... boy. Just give me a minute. Gee, where did I put the... Mm, hold on. <laughs> okay, hi. Did you get everything on your hand list? It's all in my backpack, yeah. Dad hooked me up with some cash, so we're set for the night, in case we need anything else. Or if you and Jen need anything else. Ooh la la. <sighs> okay, serious talk. What are you gonna say to Jen tonight? I don't know. Whatever. Do I need to practice? I've seen you in action. Yes. You're totally into her, right? So what? I don't have any game. These are uncharted territories for me. You're super cute. Just be yourself. That's why she's Sean. into you. Sean! I'm done, look! I made zombie blood. It's, um... Corn syrup and food coloring. Hey. Hi, <sighs> Lila. Get out of my room, Daniel. I was just... Come on, man. Just the... Just bugging the uh, shit out what? of me again after I told you to knock? Uh, yeah, but... I know. <sighs> anyway. Sean, you're an asshole. What's your problem? <gasps> but... I want to see zombie blood if you don't. <sighs> sorry, sorry. I'll make it up to him. He knows I can be a dick. I'm just stressed out about tonight. Oh, please. We're gonna have so much fun. Maybe tonight's the night... Don't jinx me. Jinx? I'm your lucky charm, bitch. <laughs> okay. So when are you coming over? I just have to hit up the momster for the car keys and hope she doesn't make me lie too much about the party. I'm already in trouble from last time. This time... Don't get caught. Let me see that drawing. This might be my masterpiece. Well, yeah. It's my portrait. Ooh, shit. Jen just posted her outfit for tonight. What? On her wall. You should check it up. It might get your attention. Hey, are you listening to me? Um, you know something called multitasking? That's a girl thing, no? I didn't mean to. Stop. Whoa. Her hair. Whoa, indeed. I told you she was super into you, man. What's her profile picture got to do with me? Huh, you will see. <laughs> I see you, Sean. Should we set the wedding date now? Hey, come on. It's just a heart. I like her hair, okay? No big deal. Sure. <sighs> Why is Leave me alone! I'll call my dad! Hold on, okay? Something's going on outside. What do you mean? Hey! Look at my shirt, asshole! What's the big deal? It's Halloween! Uh, hey, 
Don't ever touch my brother! You hear me, Brett? Fuck you, Diaz. He got his fake blood shit all over my shirt. Look! I told you, it was an accident. You better leave us alone. Oh yeah, go hide in your dad's garage. Pussies. You think you own the block? Dude, step back. He didn't mean it. He's a fucking kid. He's a fucking retard. What? What did you just say? You heard me, bitch. Don't ever touch him again. Or what? You're gonna get your daddy? Hey, asshole. I don't need him to protect me from you. Oh, you wanna go? Oh yeah, <laughs> motherfucker? Then go back to your own country. <laughs> Whoa! Sean, you hit him! Get inside now! Sean! You're dead meat, bitch! <laughs> You and your whole fucking family are going to jail, losers! What? What's going Fuck on? me! Daniel, get over here! Sean! Is he hurt? Okay! Okay, step away! Now! Calm down, officer! Shut up! And step back! On the ground! Now! Hey, wait! This guy was he started beating it. up my little Run brother. Now, hands behind your Sean. head. This is fucking bullshit. Oh no. Sean, what's Get happening? On the ground, sir. Dad, we didn't do Sean, anything. Sean, be quiet. I swear. Officer, Dad, Sean, listen. Up. I'm sorry, Dad. Daddy, be quiet. I want to go home. They're good kids, officer. Don't move. I'm sure they didn't do I anything. I said don't move. We didn't Daniel, do anything. It's going to be all right. On the ground.
No, man. We can't stop here. We gotta keep going. No pouting, okay? Come on. But... But... My feet really hurt. These shoes suck. And we've been walking for four days. What? Only two. Don't even try that shit. And my back hurts from sleeping under that stupid bridge. Yeah, so does mine. I was there too. Just knock it off. I hate it when you act like this. This is how people camp in the woods. It's not like being being at home or or in your room. This is a a real adventure, right? So Come on, let's hit the trail. Seriously. Where's Dad? Daniel, come on. We gotta go. Why isn't Dad with us, Sean? Doesn't he want to go camping too? Yes, but I told you that he can't. I told you. Okay? Okay. But I am so sick of walking. I just wish I was back in my room. I know. I know. Hey, at least we don't have to go to school on Monday, right? Yeah. Look, um, everybody's gonna be so stoked when they find out how far you walked. Really? Dad would be too. Do you think we walk like maybe a hundred miles? Probably two hundred. Feels like it. Ooh, awesome pots. But next time, Dad better get me a good pair of shoes, like yours. Dude, <laughs> Bigfoot doesn't need good shoes. I'd rather be a wolf. Ow! We could be wolves. Yeah. Yeah, that, that works. Just work on that how. Hey, you know what? Let's see if you can walk the whole way without complaining once. Huh? Uh, like, you don't whine too? I don't whine. I... I... Tag your ass and that run! You're it! No way! Not fair! Whatever. Okay. I'm a zombie, and I'm gonna eat...
there yet? Dude, stop. You know what? You're not allowed to say that. Ever again. Yes, sir. You'll be the first one to know when we get there, okay? I'm tired and hungry too. Listen, this looks like a perfect place to camp out. I bet we're not the first people to stay the night. It's creepy. There's nobody out here. We didn't even see any cars. We're gonna camp here. I'll look out for you. Hope the driver isn't around watching us. What do you find? Check it out. There's a chunky chocolate crisp bar on the dashboard. Yeah, I see it. You know I love chocolate crisp bars. I haven't had one in a million years. Yeah, right. More like two days ago. Come on. Can we please, please, please get one when we stop next? Please. Let's take this one. Nobody's gonna miss one single Choco Crisp bar. Really? I would. This is for a good cause. Oh, uh, almost. I got it. Mm -hmm. Yes. Boom. Choco Crisp is ours. Now we have dessert. Come on, let's beat it. Now we can see where we are. Whew, there's a river nearby. A river? Are we gonna go swimming? No, duh. It's way too cold for your skinny butt. Okay. There must have been a big ass storm. Ooh, landslide. Doesn't sound good. Should be. I don't know, I guess they missed that car. What if the owners come after us for the Choco Chris? And they're hunters! Daniel! Check out this mark on the tree. What is that? Graffiti? Not exactly. It's called a trailblaze. And people used to put them up to give directions. Like GPS? <laughs> yeah, sure. Just slightly more ancient. Awesome! Let's follow it. Come on, Daniel. The sun is going down. Sean? Look how big these trees are. Eh, that's only because they need the sun. Besides, they'll protect us from the rain. What if they don't? What if they... Uh, attack us? Aren't you Mr. Minecraft? I thought you loved the forest. I watched you build giant cities out of logs. I did. I built the biggest cities ever. Ooh. I can use my axe to chop up some wood. Then we can build a secret base. Well, sounds like you're ready for the woods. Lead the way. Ooh, Sean. Let's play hide and seek. Bet you can't find me. No, not right now. We stick together. Ah, uh, you're no fun. Not today, I'm not. Sorry. Whatever. Aw. Whoa. That place, what if the raccoon came with us? He could be our pet. Oh, man, raccoons are not a pet. You ever see their claws? Yeah, but this one like. I do not want to get stuck out here. We gotta find a campsite. Ho oh, ho ho. Looks like a charged creeper was here. What? How could a vine do that? Uh, I'm talking about Minecraft. Hey, 
There's another one here. Hey! I think this path leads to the river. Daniel, you hear that? <sighs> oh, yeah, we're out here. Come on, we're too big for a nest. Jeez, oh, Daniel is stuck on that ledge. Come on. I got you. <clears throat> Phew. Thanks. Uh... You see that? Looks like a clicker. Oh, yeah. Oh. Can you move over here? Ooh. Looks like a cave. Kind of, kind of spooky. No. Actually, it's kind of perfect. For what? For us, man. We're gonna stay in there. I don't know. Uh, come on, Daniel. Look, this could be our secret base. Hmm. We could fight off any skeletons or creepers with some good traps. <laughs> cool. In that case, we definitely need to get a fire going first, right? Right. Yes. Uh, so what do we need? Okay, I, I needed to build a camp to keep out all those creepers and whatever. And I'll take care of finding the wood. Deal? Yes, I can build traps too. Nothing will get to us. Awesome, dude. I know. <sighs> okay. Let's unpack. Finally. Coming!
Let's see. Here's a good spot. Now this is perfect. I can make way better traps. Ooh, we can yell as much nice as and we dry. want. Hmm. That's enough for a toasty fire. Hey, this isn't too bad. I guess Daniel can chill a little. Hey, can you give me a hand? Yeah. This is the best way to protect the base. Yo, what are you doing? I'm trying to move this branch to protect the base. Good call. Here. Let me take this side. You got it? We'll see. Go ahead and... Push! <sighs> we did it! Nothing can get in here now. Damn right. Nice work, Daniel. Cool. I'll go check the river. Feels good to focus on something after all that shit. I should take a good look at the subject before drawing. Fish, fish. Come out. Time fish, to take fish. the pen, dude. Gotcha! <sighs> no, I don't. I didn't memorize what I'm drawing. I need to take a look. If Dad was here, he'd catch every fish. We could build a really cool fort here, I bet. I've looked enough. Time to draw now. Dad gave me the sketchbook. <laughs> he was so fucking awesome. Hmm. Pretty good. But I can add more details if I want. Cool. I think I'm ready to draw this. Hmm. Not like that. I need to observe more before I can actually draw. Don't get it. It won't skip. Time to take the pen, dude. The 
face almost looks like a peaceful memory. Almost. Man, if I had a wooden axe, we could build a city out of this forest. Careful. Don't want to wake up covered in ants tomorrow. Oh, you want to challenge me? Behold my sword! Uh, who are you? Who are we fighting? Skeleton with flame arrows? Watch out! Oh, close call. Now it's our turn. Ah, right into a skull. Damn right. Thanks for having my back. Now that is a big web. <laughs> You're safe, little bro. Spiders hibernate in the fall. Good. I remember when you pushed me into that web. Hey, that was a long time ago. You got me back, right? Yeah, well, you screamed when you saw that blasted spider. <laughs> so funny. Yeah, ha ha. <laughs> At least they won't bug us tonight. <laughs> Get it? Uh, no. We have to watch out for skeletons and zombies. Not today. He's such a little guy, but he's staying strong. Wait, I'm coming. It's beautiful. Pretty amazing, huh? See? It's not so bad here in the forest. Hey, look at those clouds. What do they look like to you? I don't know. Cotton candy? That's it? Cotton candy? I don't know. What do you see? A dragon. What? Where? Okay. There's the tail. And the horns. And the fangs. And the smoke coming out of its mouth. Oh, I see it. It's awesome. Something else. There's 
a giant douchebag. <laughs> oh, yeah? Where? <laughs> right here. <laughs> right here, huh? <laughs> Let's go eat something. I bet Dad would play with... All right, and I know. We're cave people now. Time to make fire. You have a big mouth like me, so come on. Blow. Yes! Dude, don't blow it out. Sorry. Sorry. I wanted to do it like a movie. Oh, nice. It's warming up. Wish we had more. I know. Me too. Uh, I'm ready for dessert. <laughs> Go ahead. Mm, do you want a piece? Ah, uh, I'm good. You eat it. I'm the judge now. Not you. So you can't have a piece anyway. Okay. <laughs> Figures you try to get revenge, Judge. Hey, I want a new trial. Too late. Court closed. Mmm. Mmm. So good. I wish we had a cheeseburger and a milkshake like yesterday. Oh, dude. That shake was so good. Can't believe we found a diner on the way out here. <laughs> I want another one. I know. We'll get you one. Promise. You okay, buddy? Yeah. Feels good to sit down. Sean? Are you mad at me for what happened with Brett? I don't remember everything. Nothing happened. He was being a dick, that's all. Why can't I remember? Ugh, that's weird. Um, uh, don't worry, dude. You were running around all day. You tired out. It happens. Look, a full moon. Ooh. <laughs> It's not quite full yet, wolf boy. Do you think there are werewolves for real? Dude, we are the wolves. Ow! See? Ow, ow! Ow, 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 ow, ow!
Still no reception. Of course. I'm bored. Sean, can I play Mustard Party on your phone? Please. No reception, so go for it. Yeah, thanks. Oh, I'm so gonna beat your score. <sighs> Aw, come on. Almost. Almost. What? No! I was so gonna beat your score. You wish. Stupid phone. I'm so tired. We're almost broke. How do we eat tomorrow? Wonder if I'll ever go back to school after this. Oh, you look tired. Ready to crash? Uh, I think I need to go to the bathroom. I knew it. Okay, if you have to pee, then... Go. You want me to come? No, I'm not a baby. Dude, not that close. We have to sleep here. I wasn't. I was trying to find somewhere to go. Sean, I heard something. I swear. Yeah, it's a forest. There's a lot of critters out there. Scared you might pee on them? Shut up. I didn't. I think we earned some serious rest. I could sleep forever. Not on this ground. Ugh. Better than freezing out there, right? Way better. Now we have a real fire. And a secure base. You did awesome today, Daniel. Really? Hell yeah. Yeah, you're like a... a real wilderness expert. <sighs> That's cool. My eyes won't stay open, Sean. Sleep tight, bro. Hey, bro, wake up. Huh? Sean? What happened? Where's Dad? It's okay. You, you just had a bad dream. That's all. Sh Sean? Where... Where are we? Right here. In the park. Remember our amazing fire? You fortified our base, so we're perfect. Um, I did. You're right. Go, go back to sleep. You need your rest. But I might have another scary dream. You won't. I'm here. Just, just close your eyes. Thanks, Sean. I'm glad you're here. Good night, Daniel.
Look, it's easier now. We're going downhill. We just gotta keep walking. Uh, yeah, that's better. Hey, maybe we'll find a milkshake shop. Ah, oh, yes. The four secret milkshake factory. <laughs> keep dreaming, dude. Let's walk a little more. There will be a rest stop or something where we can buy food. I'm sure of it. Oh, remember that time? Harry Thompson wanted to beat me up. Me and Noah traded some games with Harry, but he didn't like his, so he said he was gonna get us after school. What did you do? We waited in the gym until he went home. That's it? You should have told me. I tried. But you said to get out of your room. I'm sorry, Nano. I should have listened. You did stand up for me. With Brett. For a change. Yeah. Well, he had it coming. Yeah. I kind of wish you weren't so mean all the time. I'm sorry, Daniel. I'm trying. Okay. Hey. There's something ahead. Yep. Must be the gas station we saw on that sign. Awesome. I'm so hungry for real food right now. I hear you. We're gonna get food, water, and plus a map so we can find the best route. All right. Hey, come on. I know. Hello there. Whoa, Sean, they have Shaco Crisp. City kid. Six down is a sharp one. How the hell do I figure that out? Daniel will scarf this down. Oh, man. It's better than tap water. We can't make a fancy sandwich. The bread will be just fine. Can't go wrong with these. Daniel, come check this out. What? What is it? It's a puppy. Super cute. <laughs> yeah, super cute. Is this yours? No, just another stray mutt. Aw, he must be sad. What's his name? That's a she. Oh, right. Oh, can we have the puppy? Please? Let me think. I don't know. It's a pretty huge responsibility. Yeah. It would be so cool. Come on. We need adults to take care of her, not kids. I know. I just thought we could. I'd love to. She's right. We can't take care of the dog right now. That's way too expensive. No way I can steal something this big. Weird to be in here after the forest. <sighs> like another world. It's expensive. But I can't let Daniel freeze. Hi, what are you looking at? Oh, hey there. Well, I'm actually doing research. It's, uh... That's way too expensive. Why? Like dirty stuff? Yeah. It's, uh, he needs a clean shirt anyway. Stuff. I'm nine years old. 
I know these kind of things. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure you do. What's your name? Daniel. Hey, Daniel. I'm Brody. Looks like you're all set to go. Is that it? Yeah. I think so. Okie dokie. Let's ring you up. And there's the damage. Ouch. Okay. We got that. Ah, oh, that's not nearly enough. Want to take out some stuff? What else do we have? Okay, got it. That's the grand total. Ouch. Okay. We got that. Ah, oh, that's not nearly enough. Want to take out some stuff? Ooh, Sean. Ouch. Check it out. It's a rat okay. Costume. I want to be a rat too. We got that. Thanks much. All right, here's okay. your change. Cool. See you later, Mr. Rat. Thanks. <sighs> Maybe Dad will do it for me for Christmas. See the baby bear, Daniel? Oh, that is awesome, possum. I mean, bear. So cool. Then he's all yours. We have a surplus, as you can tell. Really? Oh, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Beware the Halloween witch. Right. I'll just bust out my platinum card. Ten across. Hey, man, check this out. Power Bear Claw? Uh, can we play? I bet it's easy to get a prize. Yeah, no. See all those prizes still inside? Nobody wins, except the machine. Oh. Uh, but hey, we're the Wolf Brothers. Us teach this machine a lesson, right? Yes. So, who goes first? Go get him, little brother. No one can defeat. Ooh, I'm gonna beat this boss. Let's go, Power Bear Claw. Wait till you get a good opening. Not there. It sucks. Don't grab so fast. This is hard. Ugh. Can you try? Come on, Daniel. You can do it. Really? Okay. Here I come, Power Bear. Grab! No! Mm, come on! Oh, bullshit! Oops. Sorry. Mm, I hate this game. Don't give up, man. You're almost there. Yeah. I got this. Almost, almost, almost! Yes, you're mine, Power Bear! Bet you're the first one to get a prize out of here. Ooh, let's see, let's see! So cool! Look, Sean! I beat the machine! Told you nobody beats a Diaz. Too far away. Probably need a map to find it, though.
Go on. It's actually free. Cool. Thanks. It's a real nice map. You'll find lots of great hiking trails around here. Hey, look! Empty table! Oh, let's grab it and check out this map. It's our table now. <laughs> yep. Let's see. What do we got here? This is a ton of food. I thought we were broke. Not today, Dan. So let's grow it out. This is our trophy. Really? You got me a choco crisp? Of course I did. You deserved it. You guys lost? Uh, nah. We're good. Right on. Pro tip, don't feed the bears. <laughs> See you later. Whoa, that's a big map. <sighs> yeah, hope I can read it. Is this supposed to be Washington? I don't recognize anything. Yeah, me neither. But we have to be somewhere in there. Hey, I know. We're here. There's a gas station. See? Nah, no way. We were near Mount Rainier yesterday. But it's miles away now. Let me show you where we are, okay? Yeah, okay. We slept at that trout trail thing. Then we walked south for a while. All right, this is it. Are you sure? <sighs> yes, it is. It's next to the river we camped by yesterday. Here we are. Okay, so can we go there tonight? Are you kidding? It's way too far. You want to walk a whole week again? Ah, uh, but it looks cool. Hold on, I'll find where we can go. Hey kids, looks like you're out camping. Oh, yeah. Just going over trails and stuff. Seems dangerous to be out here all alone. But maybe you're the ones who need to be watched. Huh? What do you mean? We sure just... hope you paid for all that. We don't tolerate shoplifters. Uh, sir, we paid for this. And the map was free. Well, let's go inside. You can show us what you bought. Uh, no, thanks. We have to go. Nope. You're going inside. Don't make this worse for yourself, kid. Or I will. Uh, excuse us, sir. We were just hiking, I swear. Then let's find out if you're telling the truth. Come on. Uh, but we have to get going. Sean? Uh, it it's okay. Look, our our dad is waiting for us. Okay. You can call him from our phone. Now let's go. Don't touch me! Don't do it, boy! Let go! Uh, Don't touch my brother! fugitives you might be interested in. Go. They ain't going anywhere. Don't you worry. Okay. Fine. Thank you. What the fuck? Where am I? Oh, shit. Daniel. No, no, no. Don't do this to me. Police will get those two straightened out. Are you sure about this, Hank? 
I don't know. Then they'll be off our property and won't be our problem no more. If you say so, then. Well, I'll let you deal with it. No. Oh. Hey there. You finally awake? Sorry I had to secure you. But if you're innocent, don't act guilty. How's your stomach? I'm gonna tell the police you kidnapped me. Nice try. But I know who you are and what you did in Seattle. I saw it in the paper. Maybe I should call ICE to make sure you're a citizen. Fuck you, hillbilly. I'm American. Mm. <sighs> Watch it, punk. Whatever. You're going to jail for this. Pretty sure the local police will vouch for me over a thug like you. Where's my brother? Wish I knew. Little shit took off. I'll find him. Don't worry. If you touch him... You think I'd hurt a little boy? Guess you didn't have any second thoughts about leading him out into the middle of nowhere, though. That's real safe for a little kid. If he's lucky, he won't end up like his criminal big brother. Just let me go. Please. You're the reason we need to build that wall. You hold tight. I'm gonna go get your brother. Daniel? I'm right here. Are, are you okay? I, I, I think so. That old guy chased me into the woods. But I, I think I lost him. Is he gone? I'm really, really scared. <laughs> hey, Emmanuel. You're doing great. You totally fooled them. <sighs> Thanks to you, we have a chance of getting out of here. Yeah? Yeah. We gotta hurry, though. He called the cops on us. Think, dude. There's gotta be a way out of here. There's a window over there. Maybe you can find a way in or something. It is, but be careful, it might attract him. Hey, you think you can open the back door? Maybe you can enter from the store door. Oh, check it out. It was closed. Oh, shit. OK. 
Okay. Of course, the fucking keys are all the way over there. Right. Okay, Daniel. I see some keys, but I can't reach them. Maybe I can get them if I can pry this pipe off the wall. Can you find some kind of tool out there? I don't know where one is. Find me something sturdy. Like a, a screwdriver or a wrench, anything. But where can I find one? Enano, I can't really see much from where I am. There should be some tools nearby. Okay, okay, I'm looking. Daniel. Come on. Let's do this. Yes. Good job, bro. This off fast. How about these? Dude, you rock. Did that asshole see you? No way. I'm invisible. Yeah, you are. Okay. Now we gotta get my stuff Don't and go. Daniel, what? What happened? What did you do? I, I don't know. I don't know what happened. It's okay. You're safe now. You fucking little spick. You and your brother are going to jail for the rest of your life. The hell with you. Get out of here. Come on. Come on. Wait. Shit. Where are we going? Sean. Watch out. Over there. Let's go. I don't know. Oh, oh, oh. 
What are you doing out here, man? You almost scared the shit out of me. You guys okay? You don't look okay. That asshole at the gas station. You're fucking crazy. He tied me up in his back office. I swear. Dude, say no more. I believe you, okay? She's crazy out in the woods. Get in, you two. Hurry up before he catches us. And I thought I was having a shitty day. I knew that guy was sketchy. Did he mess with you too? He started to earlier. But I bought too much stuff, just to piss him off. Welcome to Redneck Land. This ain't Seattle no more. We only lived in one place my whole life. Kinda lame, but... Well, you're pretty young. You have time. That's what's great about traveling. It gives you perspective. Sometimes maybe too much. Well, don't let it phase you, little dude. You're going to meet some amazing people on the road, too. <coughs> What's under the blanket? Come on, I'm not stupid. <sighs> Daniel. What? We saved her! <laughs> We're heroes! Yeah, guess we are. <laughs> so, what should her name be? Hey, your dog, your choice. Oh, cool! Let's see. Um, mm, how about a uh, mushroom? She totally looks like a mushroom. Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Not much of a girl's name, though. Who cares? I'm sure she loves it. And so do I. <laughs> All right. Mushroom it is, then. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Thanks, big brother. See, Mushroom, you got the best name ever now. <laughs> mushroom. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I feel like I just witnessed history. You're on your way to becoming official road warriors, my dudes. <laughs> so, what do you do exactly? Long, boring story short. I come from a family with money, but no soul. I took off after school and never looked back. Now I write stories for zines and websites, do podcasts, protests, try to make some positive change. Yeah, whatever. Wow. So you're like all political. Everything is political, Sean. So, how do you make money? <laughs> Spoken like a real American. <laughs> Just curious. Now that we're urban nomads too, 
If you have any tips. I sell shit. Like a good capitalist. Stories when I can. eBay when I can't. My biggest expense is gas and food, so it's easy. Hmm. Hey, no matter what, I just try not to get cynical. Otherwise, I'd be like my family. End of the day, we have to watch out for each other, right? Yeah, you did watch out for us. Thank you. Seriously. <laughs> Looks like your brother crashed hard. Oh, good. He always goes right to sleep in cars. Yeah, and feel free to do the same. I won't take it personally. What about you? You okay to drive? Oh, yeah. This is my favorite time to drive. Traveling by night is kind of mysterious. Man, look at that. Oregon is like the edge of the world. Hmm. Hey, listen. I know what happened with you guys in Seattle. Do you want to talk about it? I'm a good listener. It's your call. No pressure. I... I don't even know what happened. It was so fast. It was the police. It's their fault. Dano just wanted to play zombie outside. Your shithead neighbor was picking on him. And I got in a fight. So dad came out to help. Somebody called the cops and, and they shot him. They killed my dad in front of me. One second my dad was alive. Then... <laughs> fucking cops. <laughs> hey, it's gonna be alright. Take a deep breath. Listen, I'm really sorry this happened to you, man. Injustice is everywhere. And you're taking the brunt of it right now. But you're gonna be okay, Sean. How? My life feels like... 
Like that town down there. Wiped out. Destroyed. Empty. Like I have nothing. What is sure is, that's the past. But you can't look back now. You've got each other. And you have to move forward. Why? You may not see it, but what you and your brother have is the most important thing. He needs you. And you need him. I can tell he doesn't know what happened. Sean, at some point, you're gonna have to tell him. I know. I just have to find the right time. Take it from me. The sooner you can address it, the better. Yeah. I'm gonna do it next chance I get. It's just... It's not gonna be easy. So then, what's your plan? Where are you going? Good question. I was thinking... Get out of the country? Fuck it. Go down to Mexico, you know? <laughs> Damn. I thought I was the long-haul traveler. <sighs> Maybe this is crazy, but... Should we just keep going? Till we get to Mexico? If you think that's the right thing to do, yes. This is exactly what you're supposed to be doing. You have family there? <sighs> Maybe. We don't even have family in the U.S. Except for grandparents we don't see anymore. What about your mom? No. No way. She's... out of the picture. But dad... He always talked about this plot of land he owns in this little coast town, Puerto Lobos. That's a pretty cool name. So it's gotta be great. Okay, so you've still got a long ways to go. We've shot the shit long enough. Time to hit the road. I'll drop you by a motel in a couple of hours. You guys could use some time to yourselves. <laughs> okay, Mushroom, you can chase me. Then, Sean. <laughs> um, no. Come, see if you can catch me. Ow! <laughs> Glad to see him act like a kid again. How will I tell him? Hey! Let's play fetch with the pup! Really? Yes! Let me do a test throw first. Cool? Well, okay. But I'm next. Okay, puppy. Go wide. Come on, mushroom! Get it! Go, Mushroom! <laughs> Good doggy. I think we need a Frisbee. Whoa! 
What did you find? You just killed a shark! <laughs> you deadly mushroom. She's awesome! Now she wants me to throw the stick. Okay, here. <laughs> Watch how fast she'll get the stick. <laughs> you go for it. Just don't throw it too far. I won't. I swear. I mean, I promise. Come on, mushroom. Come on. Look, it's a stick. Fetch! Get that stick! Looks like these two are getting along. It's good to see him like that. Well, I got you that room. Seriously? I... It's only a room. No big deal. Look, I had tough times when I started out. And some strangers saved my life. Thank you. Now's my turn to help someone. It's right there, room 10. On the second floor. Listen, I don't want to freak you out, okay, but you have to be twice as careful now. I know it's easier said than done, but you should get rid of that phone. Okay. You can always get a burner later. Trust me. And Sean, talk to Daniel. He deserves Brody, to... You're not leaving? Are you? Yes, I am, but not until Santa Brody gives you a goodbye gift. Ta-da! I, I mean, ho, ho, ho. And don't you dare argue about it. I'll leave it right here if you do. Okay, you win. Thanks, Brody. Feels good. Here. Looks like it's yours now. As always. <laughs> Hold on. I didn't forget you. I've had it since my first road trip. And it's always kept me safe. Now it's yours. Cool. Um, do you think it's okay if she wears it? Like, our official guard dog? <laughs> sure. It's your bandana now. Okay. Time for me to hit the road again. Hey, don't look so sad. You can contact me on my blog, A Tribe Called West. So, you better keep me posted when you can, okay? We will. Thanks again, Brody. <laughs> ah, bro hug. Wish you could stay with us. Me too, kid. <sighs> Sorry, I'll probably think of a better goodbye when I'm on the road, but until then, take care, my dudes. I'm gonna miss him. Me too. Okay. Time to hit the sack. Don't worry, Mushroom. I got you.
Okay, good. Looks like the manager's asleep for the night. Shouldn't have any trouble from them. Do you think it will have Netflix or a jacuzzi? Dude, this is some hotel, not an Airbnb. If you're lucky, it'll have cable and a hot shower. I'm gonna throw you in, cave boy. We can watch TV too. And there's a balcony. Whoa, this is nice and warm. Oh, this bed is soft. What about this one? Uh, not bad, but too far from the TV. Can I take the one in front of the TV? Huh? Want to play it over rock, paper, scissors? Oh, there's no way you can beat me, bud. Ready? I am so ready to beat you. Aw, shoot. I told you, man. Can we play another round? Come on. Sure, I mean, you're gonna lose again, but suit yourself. Not this time. Aw, come on. Not fair. You lost, man. What's not fair? I wanted that bed. Eh, take it. For real? I don't really care. Awesome. They're the same, you know? Yeah, but I like this one better. All right, I'm gonna run a bath. We totally reek. Especially you, Pigpen. <laughs> I wouldn't be so sure, Cave Boy. I'll call you when it's ready. Uh, I'll be right here. Of course you will. Oh, cool. Hot Dog Man is on. Oh, I remember this episode. Man, Man it's on so late. Wish we still had Brody around. for everything, Brody. I'll be extra careful. So, what's up? The buns want to catch Hot Dog Man and turn him into sausage meat. Oh yeah. The giant meatball attacks in the next episode, right? Yes, and they get to meet the city mayo. <sighs> Man, it's been ages. Why don't you watch Hot Dog Man with me anymore? I'm too old, dude. And I've seen it so many times. <laughs> okay, Grandpa Sean. It feels so good to sit down and watch TV. <laughs> True. Okay, I'm done here. You're missing the best part. I know, but I gotta take care of the bath. Don't forget you're up soon. I know. Let's put this in the bathroom for Prince Daniel. Uh, 
yuck, Sean. It's a condom in my bag. Gross. Hey! Daniel will love this. This episode is awesome. You should sit down and watch it with me. Ah, damn. That fucking redneck hit me hard. I hit him harder, though. Ready? Aw, the episode's almost finished. Nice try. The water's hot. Come on. Yeah, okay, I'm going. Oh my god. Whoa. So many bubbles. Try and keep them in the bathtub. I will. Promise. Thanks. And no, the dog is not taking a bath with you. Okay, okay. Don't worry. I should throw my phone away while Daniel is washing. He'd freak out if he... Time to say goodbye to modern life. Lila's freaking out. Maybe I should leave her out of this, or she'll get into trouble too. Sean? Hey, Lila. Sean, is that you? Do you... Sean! Oh, God. Are you okay? I guess. I'm... I'm in a motel. With Daniel. <laughs> Shit! Everyone's looking for you here. Fuck. I didn't do anything. I know. God, this is so messed up. The cops are talking to everybody at school. This is a nightmare. We're fucked. Sean, don't say that. It will be okay. I miss you so much. Maybe you could come back. You know I wish I could, but we can't take that risk. They're, they're gonna put me in juvie. Daniel. Bullshit. You're innocent. And I've got your back. No matter what. No way. I'm not gonna let you get in trouble for me. Stop acting like I'm never gonna see you again. That's bullshit. I'm sorry. I totally hate this. I guess the freaking fighters are disbanded for a while. Shit actually changes, I guess. So, where are you going? Um, we're just going away for now. I'll call you if I get a chance. I miss you, Lila. Sean, wait. <sighs> okay. Wait. Okay, okay. And action! Daniel! Get your butt in here right now. What? What did I do? You forgot to open this present. <laughs> what is this? Socks? Underwear? That's it? Yeah. Pretty cool, huh? That's what I got when I was a kid. <sighs> Not funny. <laughs> yeah, it is. Dude, check out your face. Wait, what? What? There's another one. 
on here? What is it? Daniel, let me help. Looks bigger than underwear. Oh, what? No way. Kim, the new Playbots? Thank you, Santa. Hey, don't look at me. You were a good boy this year. <laughs> Daniel, uh, come here. We need to talk. Can we get a drink first? I'm thirsty. Right now? You said I could have a Coke. Or something. Okay, I'll get you a soda. But when I come back, we're going to talk. Serious. Fine. What's the big deal? I just... Just don't lie to me ever again. Ever. I promise. 
promise I won't lie to you again. I promise. I'm serious, Sean. I know. Me too, Danny. What are we going to do without him? Shh. It's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. Sean, am I a monster? Nothing is wrong with you. You're different. Okay. What are we gonna do now? I was thinking... Maybe we could go to Puerto Lobos. Her dad grew up, you know? Yeah, I guess. It'll be fine, Daniel. There's nothing we can't do. As long as we're together. Can you tell me a story? Like he did? I'm not as good as him. <laughs> he used to tell me bedtime stories, too. Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home there with their papa wolf. They all lived happily together.
All right. Come on, man. Focus. Okay. Trust me. You can do it. 